Hey guys, it's like and back with another review. Today we are going to be reviewing. Now, pardon my language, but I might butcher this name. This is the Razer Spex V2 Mini, the ultra thin gaming mat, commonly known as a gaming mouse pad. So, I've just unboxed this thing. First thing I notice is obviously you have your uh, <laughs> Razer logo stickers that come in, well, every box if you've ever bought a Razer product. And I've removed the plastic film off of the bottom of this thing. First thing I notice, it sticks so well to my little desk here that it's hard to pick up. Like, if I grab it by this side, it like it's like a, it's like a sticker, <laughs> almost, except... It's not really sticky, it's just a really weird material. And one thing that's really special about this mouse pad is its price. And this is one of the main reasons why I'm able to review something like this, obviously. It's not your common uh, $50 <laughs> Razer um, freaking mouse pad, but it's, well, in Canada, I bought this from Walmart, it retails at about $9.97. Now, for a Razer gaming mouse pad, just a gaming mouse pad in general, if you're looking for something on a budget, you can't beat that price. You just can't. So, I am going to start gaming with this momentarily, and I'm going to cut the clip, and I'll come back and give you a review of what I think after using it for its general purpose. So, we'll be right back. Now, you guys are very lucky because between those two clips was roughly a 24 second, I believe it was 24 seconds, 24 second transition of me just playing some Fortnite, which is what I was playing in that clip. But for me, it has been roughly an hour and 15 minutes on the clock playing Fortnite, TF2, Realm Royale. I tested it out on a lot of games say the least. And honestly, I think I'm going to say that this mouse pad is good no matter what, considering that the mouse pad I had before this one was this $1.25 dollar store mouse pad. <laughs> but on an actual um, reviewer level, just pretending I didn't have this mouse pad before, which is kind of difficult to do because it's terrible. Um, this mouse pad, now I'm not going to tell you it made me a god immediately, but if you're someone who's generally good at gaming, I think genuinely that this mouse pad will improve your game. The way the mouse glides across the mouse pad, and the way it feels just a lot more responsive, it's hard to explain, well, it did say that on the actual casing for the thing, which was fairly small compared to other Razer mouse pads. Um, yeah, it's just all around a great mouse pad. If you ask me to rate it on a scale of 1 to 10, I would give this a 10. And that's no word of a lie. I rate this thing 10 out of 10. If you need a gaming mouse pad and you're on a budget, this is your mouse pad. But this is not sponsored by Razer, by the way. I should probably just throw that disclaimer out there. But, yes, I would recommend this mouse pad to any beginner gamer who's on a budget. And, with that said, this is, yeah, just great. So, if you enjoyed this review, um, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, share, all that good stuff. And, if you happen to pick up one of these on your own, Hope you enjoy. I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye!